As a deaf person, I understand that there will always be challenges. Life will always be challenging. And it's really just about picking your challenge. Hi, how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, good. Uh, what's your name? My name is Jean. Ludovine. Ludovine. My name is Ludovine. Ludovine. Name. <laughs> My name's Gigi. But it's really Genevieve. It's a long name. <laughs> That's why it's summarized. Yes. <laughs> you sign? I sign and my major is ASL in sign language. <laughs> I want to become an interpreter. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what's your major? My major is social. Um, general studies here, but social work will not transfer to um, UMBC. Wow, nice. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, what do you like about this college? I like the fact that it it brings it bring, it bring, um, hearing and deaf people together. It connects like all the different campuses together, like from Germantown to Rockville, uh, or Rockville to uh, uh, Silver Spring, or no, it's, yeah, Tacoma. Yeah. Tacoma yeah. Park. Yes. I like this college too. Um, I like MC. <laughs> yeah. Why? Um, I like um, that they have uh, good diversity. Diversity. Okay. Yeah, diversity. Yes. I love ASL and I'm here to learn ASL. <laughs> um, where are you from? I'm from Cameroon. In Africa? Mm hmm. Wow. West Africa, actually. When did you come to the States? When I was a long time ago, but like, like, like one, when I was like two, round three. three. Okay. <laughs> three. Around three years old. Three years old. <laughs> I'm from here. <laughs> well, I'm from Richmond, Virginia. Wow, Virginia. Yeah, Virginia. I grew up in Virginia. <laughs> And I went or into the the Marines military. Oh, really? Yeah, for four years. <laughs> then I'm out. And then I got out. And long story short, I'm here. <laughs> and you know, um, I really like it here. I wanted to join the military, but but they wouldn't accept. Um, yeah, deaf, deaf people. people, which is a shame. <laughs> yes, that's a shame. <laughs> so what's it like to come here to, and to school as, deaf, as a deaf person uh, with hearing people? <laughs> is it hard okay. sometimes? <laughs> hard? Or is it okay? Hard mm -hmm. yeah. all the time. All the time. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Yeah. Have, having to, to constantly lip read. Yeah, to lip read. It'd be hard. Oof. I only wish they didn't it some of Some of them do, but I wish all of them did. And more people are learning ASL. It's really, it's really cool. I like that environment. <laughs> yeah. 
time to go environment. 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 Uh -huh. I love that environment. <laughs> <laughs> so why is it hard? And like, like what do you have like have to do on a daily, like every day, you know, to deal with speaking people? <laughs> For well, one, and and um, and conversation, like between between the hidden person and me, um, we um, is it sometimes like feel like they don't understand? Yeah, sometimes exactly. Mm -hmm. Um, an example would be in the in the in the ambassadors meeting. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I, I'm an ACES ambassador, so... Um, nice. Mm -hmm. cool. As an ACES ambassador, um, we have, we have, we have a, a monthly meeting on Tuesday. But, uh, but um, some, one of the issues I was having with, is, was um, when the interpreters are not, are not, are not here early, uh, they're earlier than I've been dead. So sometimes the interpreters no, are not there. No, it's not that. Sometimes, sometimes I get here, I get there early. Yeah, I get there early. But, mm -hmm. but, the, but the interpreters are not there because because they were because they didn't know that that uh, that I was getting there early. Um, so one of the issues were were that. I would have to constantly lip read until the interpreters get there. Yeah, that sounds that sounds really, really challenging and hard. <laughs> yes. yes. As a as a as a veteran, um, what uh, what are some of the challenges we face? Oh, well, it's a different world. <laughs> um, but I mean, I've been, I've adjusted. And I've changed, <laughs> but you know, like I still like I feel uh, the influence and experience from the past, you know. Um, but you know, I'm here. It's a different stage in my life. But um, what stage are you? Um, I'm just focusing on the future, really, and. <laughs> Not really focused on the past as much. <laughs> yeah. Um, challenges, there are, I think there aren't a lot of challenges actually. I've adapted <laughs> and overcome. <laughs> Time for yeah. adapting. Adapted. Adapted. <laughs> like how, how does uh, coming here to MC help you adapt and you know, uh, overcome the challenges? Um, as a as a deaf person, um, I I understand I understand that there will always be past of always be challenges. With, um, like at, at workplaces, but but I'm um, um, but I'm um, she gets gets you prepared for those challenges. I agree. <laughs> I agree. So, um, what about you? What? For me, um, yeah, I mean, life will always be challenging. <laughs> and it's really just about picking your challenge. And um, uh, coming here to college, to NC, is um, it's helping me see more diversity, or diversity? Diversity. Huh? Diversity. And helping helping me <laughs> you know change in that way it's good <laughs> how did it help you um exposure exposure to like uh, to deaf people to all of my professors are deaf and i really really uh, i love that <laughs> yeah and um just the consistent learning environment <laughs> and you know i like it a lot. <laughs> um, I'd like to know something though. Um, 
Why do you want to do if? Why do you want to make you an ASL? I love, love ASL. <laughs> and um, it feels right to be pursuing and focusing on ASL. So, I want to become an interpreter <laughs> in the long run. And I'm excited about it. <laughs> I mean, what what makes it what makes what makes it right to me? Well, like ASL is a language is well, besides English is my favorite language. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, it just I started learning ASL and continued, continued, and I still have <laughs> a lot to learn, but I'm excited majoring in ASL. How about you? Like, what's, uh, why do you want to major and see and become a social worker? <laughs> um, I've always wanted to have the, I've always had the passion to help people. Um, um, people in foster care, homelessness, military. <laughs> You'll have a lot of, a lot of work. <laughs> yeah. I have, th those are my, those are my, those are the three study projects I want to start with. How are, um, interactions with you and students, hearing students, deaf students, um, uh, teachers here, like, how are interactions for you? I I only know like what I only know two people at at, at the college college wide that that is Jeff. Um, um, but 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 they're but they're not. But, but, but we're not constantly in, in, in touch. So it's hard to interact with deaf people. Mm. So, but, but for hearing people, it's also, it's also hard because, um, because, because, we, because when, when they talk, when, like we talk and like, um, in, in the cafeteria, there's a the the Germantown campus cafeteria. We 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 we, we sit together and and um, and communicate with each other. But the one thing is, is that that I that I feel is isolation during, during that time because especially during that time because because they're not. Um, do they know ASL? <laughs> yeah, they they don't know, they don't know uh -huh. ASL, so it's kind of hard to constantly keep the feeding constantly. But it's tiring sometimes. Yeah, <laughs> but but I I still try to I still try to keep going through it. That's good. <laughs> um, what about you? How are how her interaction with the world? Um, I, as a veteran? Well, for me, it's a little bit easier mm -hmm. um, because I'm hearing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but because of my background and past, sometimes I'm thinking to myself, like, they don't know <laughs> <laughs> um, how long a actual walk is, but that's another story. Like overall, like all of the students here are pretty, pretty cool, nice. Um, the environment is nice. I, I'm, I'm still young, so I don't have <laughs> problems. You know, like my interactions with people. I think. What do you like to do in in your spare time? Hmm. Um. Sometimes I like to play the piano. Really? Wow. <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> uh, sometimes I'm just lazy. I'll watch a movie, a good movie. <laughs> sometimes I like a good hike, you know, the park. <laughs> like, um, how about you? What do you like to do? Doing in your free time. 
then <coughs> they mess with him. I like to hike me yeah, same. But I, I also love being outside. I, 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 I hate being indoors. You know, the only thing I like about being indoors is, is baking. That's it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like baking, too. <laughs> yes. Imagine something before, before... Oh, like watching a good movie? Before that. Oh, playing the piano? Yes, that. Piano. Um, I have a piano at home, so it's a, so I, um, do you want to learn? I, <laughs> I had taken piano before, it was oh. just one semester, one class in, in Rockville High School, um, but, but I wish they had, they had, they, they had pursued it, like, keep pushing, push, keep, like, going on again. Oh, that's cool. Like, maybe sometime we can, like, I can teach you. <laughs> yes. I had it, how to read and notes. <laughs> and, I need you know, that. Yeah. <laughs> I need that. Yeah, dynamics, everything. All. <laughs> <laughs> How about this? You, you, you teach me piano. I teach you some, some more time. Oh, deal. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Thank you for, for, for letting me talk with you. Uh, um, and, and, uh, and, and, I hope, and I hope to see you on campus. Same. You know, I'm glad to be talking with you and you've opened my eyes. <laughs> Thank you for talking with me today. <laughs> no problem. Right. Nice oh. to meet you. It's nice to meet you too. <laughs>